I'm Joe O'Brien. I'm a director of engineering for an aerospace company in Grand Prairie, Texas. It's called Triumph Accessory Services Grand Prairie. Um, I live in Cockhill. Well, I came in under the 28-day uh, kickstart uh, program, and uh, you know, I've always one to to want to push myself to become better. Um, definitely saw this as an opportunity to do that. Uh, in the Kickstart program, it was a way to kind of have a minimal entrance, minimal investment, um, and yet see if this was really going to work. I'd been in enough programs where it really wasn't beneficial, and I didn't want to just say, hey, I'm going to commit right from the get and say that this is this is going to work. I know it's going to work. It's got to work uh, when there had been so many failures that had happened in the past where it was like it just wasn't, wasn't right, it wasn't working right, wasn't having the kind of results that I expected. Um, so really, that was the, the entrance I had into the program. Well, I walked on my hands everywhere I went. Um, couldn't use my legs at all. Um, oh wait, no, that's not true. Not true. Um, yeah, it wasn't. It wasn't a complete uh, transformation coming into the program and then afterward. But it's extremely noticeable the benefit that it's had for me. Um, prior to this, I I worked out infrequently, and it was just a fight to try and get there. Um, so following it, it's been very helpful to have that consistency to work out on a regular basis, which I think is vital. Uh, I was concerned a little bit. I wanted to make sure that I, that I could do it and do it well. Um, I was excited that it was very proprioceptive, so I didn't feel like I was getting used to the workout. And yet at the same time, um, it was at my own pace. Uh, and I like to push myself. Um, I think that's important. But I also like that it was, hey, you know, stay within yourself. This is a long-term thing in order to get you back in shape. Um, and I definitely got that loud and clear. Um, first week, uh, you know, was, was very beneficial. Um, I started to see that this could really be something different. This could really be beneficial. Um, first month, I mean, I was losing weight. I was losing inches um, and feeling better. So I could definitely see the results starting to come. Sure. I think has been one of the things that, that's helped me a whole lot. Um, definitely as, you know, early on in the process, it was very helpful um, to have a, a resource. Um, I know I've wanted to improve, but how do you do that? Um, I'm not a nutrition major, um, and I, I've always felt like that was a missing link. So that was very helpful for me, some of the recommendations for what to eat, um, pairings of foods so that you're getting a good balanced diet. Um, and not dieting per se, but just good food, and here's the kinds of food and the kinds of quantities, you know. Um, so I always, I would say I, I felt like I ate better than I really did. Um, I ate more than I did. Um, when I ate out, I would have different sauces and things like this, not thinking that they were as uh, detrimental as I now know that they are. Um, and so now just that knowledge really, really helps. Um, to that end, the fitness app, my fitness pal helps quite a bit um, just to be able to keep me accountable on a daily basis. And I don't use it as much anymore, um, but that initial, that first month was, was really, really helpful. A lot of these things, I guess for me, center around the knowledge and the accountability. And um, so the, the trainers, obviously, uh, with GYS help immensely just to say, hey, you know, if you have a little bit of a question, you have a resource to be able to say, okay, what about this? What about that? Um, and it helps to get that ongoing feedback. You know, I don't think we learn everything overnight, so it's a commitment on an ongoing basis. A scale, uh, just to weigh myself on a regular basis, helps just to say, whoa, that didn't work very well. And then a scale for food, just to say, whoa, that was that was actually more than I realized it was from a caloric intake. Um, so I think those are the, the primary tools that I've benefited from. You know, I've had um, quite a bit of different experiences, so this is, is not just a limited um, frame of reference either. Um, but it definitely is different. Um, and, and I think part of it is maybe where I am in my life, where I'm receptive to a lot of the things. Um, but, you know, I've gone through different collegiate programs and professional things and um, kind of seen what was good and what was bad. Um, like I said previously, I think there's a, there's a real focus on nutrition. There's a, there's a holistic mentality about the program. And I think that that's, um, that's vital to success. If you're gonna say, hey, you can work out and you can bust your butt, but you can eat bad stuff. I mean, we all know what you put in is what you get out. Um, so I think the effort obviously is important and the trainers help you to do that to, to put forth your best effort on a regular basis. That definitely helps me. 
Um, but the food is vital. You know, are you eating good stuff on a regular basis? Are you having enough water? Um, I like the group mentality. I mean, it's not just like you're working out on a team and everybody's doing their own workout. Everybody's doing the same workout most of the time. Uh, now, you might be doing different intensity levels or whatever um, based on your fitness level, but uh, you're there, and I think it really helps just to have people uh, keeping you accountable. That kind of feedback on an ongoing basis. Trainer-led is great, and I love being outside. There have been numerous uh, benefits. I have um, definitely lost weight. Um, I think more than that, though, I've lost, um, and, and I think it's, uh, it's going on about 10 pounds now. Um, I've been in about a month and a half. Um, lost almost 10 pounds that very first month, and then have stabilized somewhat, but I've been able to maintain that. Now I'm looking for that next push. Um, the, but that said, I can see that my muscle tone has increased. Um, that, uh, I mean, I've definitely lost inches where uh, I can see quite a big difference. Um, and I've been interested in, in, in pursuing running before this program. But um, this has just accelerated my, my ability to run more, to run longer. Um, and I think that's a, a big part of this is that you're not just doing um, aerobic activity and you're not just doing anaerobic activity. There's a good mix of both of them. So, and I think they feed off of each other. And so it's definitely helped me to, to get stronger, to stay more upright in my posture when I'm running. My uh, speed has increased considerably. My endurance has increased considerably. My knees were hurting um, and that pain's subsiding. Uh, it's not completely gone, but it's subsiding quite a bit. Um, and I can definitely tell when I've not worked out on a, a, you know, in a couple of days. Um, neck feels better, back feels better. I'm actually sleeping better, even though I'm sleeping less, because I'm coming and working out at 5.30, but um, it's just been numerous benefits. I think, I think um, you, if you want changes um, in your life, then you're really, um, looking for something that is sustainable, um, that uh, is not just flash in a pan, um, and that takes into account uh, your whole person, you know, um, then this is, a, this is a great program. But it does require a good commitment to say that I'm gonna eat well, I'm gonna do it on a daily basis, I'm gonna come on a regular basis. I love the fact that um, this program makes sense. It's not like I'm just, you know, only eating protein on a regular basis. Um, you know, it's not like I'm, um, you know, not drinking water or just weird fad diets and things like this. It makes sense to me that if I put in hard work and effort and eat well and you know, mathematically I have a good number of calories. That hey, this this makes sense. Um, my body should be more efficient if I increase my metabolism. Just all that stuff comes together. So I would just say uh, to somebody looking for it is. This is extremely beneficial, but as much as it requires the get you in shape, resources and the trainers um, and that community comes around and the group comes around and, and really helps just on a daily basis where you're all struggling together, um, it requires a commitment um, from the person that's, that's working out to say that I really want changes personally. There has to be that deep motivation. And I like that that was the very first session that, that we had with Brad was, What's your motivation? Where are your goals coming from? And how are we gonna get there? Because it's not just about that particular goal, and he definitely made that clear. It's about what's behind that goal. Why are you trying to get to a weight loss goal? Um, you know, so, so for me, a lot of it is, is family. It's not wanting to be sedentary. It's not wanting to have that kind of lifestyle and look back 10 years and say, oh my gosh, I got this huge hill decline. Um, but to be able to say, okay, I've got that, and I'm just gonna maintain that the rest of my life. So. I, You've got to be committed.